Hey everyone, it's Catherine. I know I haven't done a haul in forever, forever, but there's a reason I'm doing it, and that's because there have been some crazy summer sales going on. I stocked up on so much clothing because I realized a lot of my closet is stuff I literally wore in eighth grade. So I have stuff from ASOS, J. Crew, Gap, Loft, Lulu, Nike, like I have a huge range of stuff and if you want to know what sales are going on, I've plugged this website a ton um, just because I use it all the time, but it's called Shop Tagger. I'll link it down below, but you can basically track any item you want on almost every retailer and that way you'll know when like the next 4th of July sale is going on or a Father's Day sale or like anything like that. Um, it has been a godsend and that's how I got most of these items, not for full price. In fact, I don't think I got any of the stuff in this haul full price. First up, J. Crew and J. Crew Factory specifically have a ton of like clearance sales, always have some sort of discount on the site, so I've been loving them. I got this necklace right here. Just, it's a really, really big necklace, but I love the periwinkle color, and it definitely is like a statement to wear if you have like a very neutral dress. And the second one is a classic style. Um, you have sort of a two-tone there, so it is wearable, um, and a little bit of a smaller sort of statement necklace, not as bold. Next, I've been reading the College Prepsters blog a ton, and she recently bought this, and I wouldn't usually go for like this sort of color, but I love this sweatshirt. It's super preppy and I waited a bit for it to go on sale and eventually I got it for like 20 bucks, which I think is a steal. It's a really nice lightweight summer sort of hoodie if you want to wear it to the beach. That's like the perfect occasion if you live on the coast. Last thing, you'll probably notice a lot of the stuff in this haul is of the sort of like business casual variety because, you know, I am finishing up college, I will be going out into the working world and I am an internship right now. So, I bought this polka dot skirt, definitely still in my style, like super bold, like definitely cute print, but it is like a nice um, lightweight, but still business casual material, and does have a slit in the back, which you'll see in the clip of me wearing it. Also, I want to apologize for my congested voice. The good thing or the bad thing about YouTube is that I have no coworkers. There's no one else to get sick. I can't transmit those through the screen, hopefully. So it's fine. I can still do my do my job even when I'm a little bit under the weather. Next up is something I've been wearing in my vlogs and I've gotten a lot of questions about. It's super wrinkled right now. It is this two-piece. The bottoms are just a super flouncy short. Like you would think they'd be see-through, but surprisingly not, as long as you wear nude stuff underneath. Um, but very, very, very lightweight, so you can um, wear it to any sort of hot summer day. Like I said, it's a two-piece. You do have the matching top. Looks like a crop top, but ladies, it hits like right where the shorts are, so if you don't want to show any skin, you don't have to. It is very, very flattering, um, and honestly, like an ideal summer outfit. Literally $20. I got it off of Twitter, so it's from a site called like Cupshe, which is a Chinese site, and typically I don't venture up to do those sort of things, but this one is actually good quality so far. Next up, if you haven't tried ordering from ASOS or ASOS, it's A-S-O-S dot com. It's only an online retailer, so you can't try on anything, but they have amazing like virtual runways where you can see how the products move. If you want to check out any of these items, I'll link them down below. But the first one I got here is a wrap dress. So as you can see, like super, super wide, but in the clip you see on me, you'll see that this dress is extremely flattering. It is a longer sleeve and it's a beautiful color. Again, I'm pretty lightweight. Um, really really versatile you can wear it to like just a nice date or like running errands or a class like it's a perfect perfect dress and I got it on sale from ASOS tall which is for us tall ladies if you're curvy they have ASOS curvy if you're petite they have ASOS petite so they have all of those different styles that actually really do fit me I usually wouldn't go for a romper but I went with a romper because ASOS tall really does fit this one has pockets and it's this beautiful little floral pattern with some stitching up the front. Um, it's a really cute cut, again, like really, really lightweight, which is really nice and I like the material. So um, this one again was on sale and from ASOS Tall. The top I'm wearing is from ASOS. I really, really like it. If you're following me on Instagram, you've seen this top, but I love the little crochet detail and the fit. It is a little bit see-through, but I'm wearing it with this rust skirt. I'll put a clip in here of me wearing that. Super on trend with the buttons up the front, the scalloping, the suede, like rust color. So it is a suede material, so it's a little bit harder to take care of. But again, got it super on sale, whereas typically if you bought it from like American Apparel, it's gonna cost you like 60 plus dollars. Um, this one was super affordable. And then I also picked up some shoes from ASOS. They are like the most basic shoe you've ever seen. 
I've never worn a heel before, so I finally want to try one out, and these ones are pretty affordable. Suede, um, really cool pointy toe with a different sort of shape, and it's like just like a two inch heel, so it's very, very wearable. I'm gonna hit Lulu really quick. I've only bought one item from Lulu in the past few minutes just because if you're trying to shop on a budget, Lulu's not the place to do that, but this pair, I think I got out slightly on sale. You absolutely cannot tell what they are, but they are cropped, um, just plain black yoga pant, like a super basic item, but better than any yoga pants I've ever tried on before. And if you're looking to buy stuff from Lulu, don't buy now, wait till their semi-annual sale. And the best way to know when that happens is to just tag any sort of thing off the website um, on Shop Tagger, and then the moment that they go on their semi-annual sale, it could be at like 3 a.m. during the night time, you'll be notified and that way you can be the first on because they sell out of sizes real quick because they do not, you know, have huge blowout sales at Lulu very often. But super pleased with this pair of pants if you've been looking to stock up on a nice pair. Sticking with the athletic theme, even though I'm the least athletic person you know, I will be going to band camp for marching band at USC in August, where it's very hot on the turf, and so I picked up some Nike shorts from the outlet. So again, Nike's not a site that goes on sale very much, but I got each of these shorts for like $20, which I think is good. I never buy this kind of stuff, but they do have like the little um, short underneath them, and they're really, really short, I will say that, but black and gray. And I mainly bought shorts so I can get this pair right here. Adorable print, my favorite color. And then they have this like white mesh on the side. So, you know, I typically would just buy like athletic shorts from Goodwill or something because it really doesn't matter. But these were really, really nice quality and just some really cute um, styles. So I went for it. Next up is Gap. If you haven't shopped at Gap in store, at least in the one nearby me, the clearance section is rad. Like there's so much, you might as well not even shop upstairs in the normal section. Um, and they do have a good range of styles. So I picked up this white skirt here. I love white in my wardrobe and especially if it has really southern patterns. So you'll see here, this one has a really beautiful crochet effect to it. And it's like the perfect length, um, cause it's not like a mini skirt, but it's not like too long either. Really, really love it. Chino shorts are a must. I just like the look rather than denim shorts. So I got this color pair cause it lo looks really good with a white or a navy or even like a deep like plum color. So um, these ones are a little bit longer. So I tend to roll them up. Um, but from Gap, they're pretty good quality if you don't want to go for like J. Crew or the equivalent. I know I've been blazing through these pieces, but when I watch hauls, I literally skip to watch each, each clip. You might not even be watching this because you don't want to hear me talking, but if you want more information on the products, I will do my best to link them all down below. Otherwise, they're not there out of stock. So this one's also from Gap. I saw this back in December, so when you're looking for pieces, wait a while because I bought it in May and it was like seven, it was like six dollars on clearance. So I'm very, very happy. It's just a little bit of asymmetrical. So you have the, it's a, it's like a wrap skirt asymmetrical. So you have the zipper down here and it is wool. So it's more of like a winter skirt, although it is like a mini skirt. It's a little confusing on like how I'll wear this, but it was six dollars and then it was like another 40% off that. So I just could not pass it up because um, that was an insane clearance and there's nothing even wrong with it. It was just that no one was this size, I guess. I don't know. Victoria's Secret had a good sale and also they're not going to be making swimwear anymore, if as I heard. So I went with this top again and it's like Nike short color that I really like. It's not coming up the same on camera. Gotta bless these Sony, Sony cameras here, but um, it does have some padding. And then what I like is that it's almost just like a regular halter because I just need something that you can wear in the ocean and isn't just like a pretty swimsuit that's not functional because you can see those all the time on Instagram. I want something that actually works. So it does have this double strap and then the double strap continues around the back. Um, very, very simple. You can see it's a little padded here, um, but yeah, there was a sale on Victoria's Secret. I'm sure the same, I think the same manual is going on right now, so you should probably peep the website. Last but not least, I'm not sure many other people besides me shop at Loft. It tends to be a little more on like the blouse, business casual side, definitely like older, like mom aged women, but they do tend to have some youthful stuff as well, so I picked up this. I needed some more good quality tank tops that 
I wouldn't have worn in eighth grade. And so I like this one because of the little detailing right here. Super flattering shape. I love the color as well. It comes in like four different colors. And then has this little peephole in the back, which is very, very cute. So recommend this one as well as it's sort of like sister tank top, I would say. These two kind of like seem like they're in the same collection. But this one is really cool because it has this nice deep V. There's no buttons or anything, so it just kind of opens up like that. But it doesn't reveal too much. And I love the pattern on the front, and then it's completely just plain but incredibly soft material on the back. If you want to see some styling of these outfits, the best sources for that would be my Instagram and also my vlog channel where you can see me like what I wear day to day. But if you liked this video, I know a haul is out of the ordinary for me, please let me know down below. Let me know what your favorite item was and I'll be sure to reply back to you. Have a great summer everyone. Thanks for watching and Cather out.